Meet Madman Dan, salesman extraordinaire. For 20 years, he's been closing deals on anything that moves. It's glass, metal, rubber, and plastic. They all gotta be slashed. Jet skis, power boats, autos. But that's just the beginning. Everything brings out the closer in Dan. Wow, free samples, I'm excited. Ooh, ooh, ooh. hold on a minute. Overpowering hip hop music. I'm in Florida, I'm looking for fruit and souvenirs, and I'm getting thumped over the head with hip hop. Got to go. This week, it's a Harley dealership that's brought in Madman Dan and his team. It's hardcore bikers versus the ultimate closer, and only one team wins. I'm Madman Dan, and I've assembled a team of the world's greatest salesmen. Big Ben. And I'm Big Ben. He's the charmer. So we don't sell 70 or 80 of them, I get fired? Foot Vix is the ball of unadulterated energy. Oh, no! Here we go! That means you! Jumpin' Jack Slash. He's our renaissance man. Look at this $88 bike right here. I'm Madman Dan. And me, I'm Madman Dan, and I run the show. Yeah! This is how I see the world. It's got gigantic billboards with unbelievable colors advertising their product at an unbelievable price. But what do you do all the time to sell more? You need some actual humans interacting, ready to do business. Are you ready for the deal of the century? This weekend, we're taking over a large Harley Davidson dealership. Our goal, sell 100 bikes. But if we don't sell at least 75, we'll be fired. That won't be easy. A dealership this size normally sells 10 to 20 bikes on a weekend. That means we'll be looking for over a 600% increase. But that's how good we are. All right, here we go. It's showtime. The most important part of any sale for me is there's two people to sell. One is the consumer, but two are the salesmen. It's Friday morning at 7.30 in the morning. Everybody's asleep now. I gotta dust them up, I gotta pump them up. Because if they don't believe in the sale, then I got no chance to win. So I gotta go in there, I gotta light them on fire. Together, we will sell, sell, sell. Remember, the key to the sale this weekend, and we're going to talk about it, is excitement and control. Much as we're talking about this morning, you know, we're going to have a big sale. What do you say? Can we have a big sale? Yeah! yeah. What I like to do with every sale is start with our favorite word, and you know what that is? What is it? Yes. yes. Right? Let's practice that one more time. Yes. yes! Yes! Here we go. Yes! 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 As far as strategy goes, let's start with the fence. You notice that we have a shoot situation here. What we're trying to do is make sure that everybody stops in the front so that we can get a chance to talk to them. This is a key part of our strategy. The goal is to sell 100 bikes, but even the slasher's minimum of 75 will be a huge boost to the dealership. The slashers use a secret code to determine discounts while still maintaining a profit. The code here basically says that this is a 2,000 motorcycle and they own the bike for $10,400. So anything that we get above $10,400 is profit for the dealership. That's good for them and good for us. Everybody who buys a bike today, we got a Carnival Cruise Rides to Mexico! Oh man, I just got back. It was nice. It was like 80 degrees. They're giving the customers to fill out these tags. Now the tag has all the information you need. I mean, the salesperson needs to know in order to make the deal. I mean, what the guy's credit is. I mean, how is he going to pay for the vehicle? Um, cash or finance? I mean, and the customer's walking around with this tag around the neck, and they don't know it. But I mean, just at a glance, you can tell what kind of customer it is. When a tag goes on a bike, it's a sale. The first sale sets the tone for the entire day. Now we're going in. We're thinking. Right, we're looking at a beautiful. Night train. This is a beautiful 2008. You like to go black? Oh, yeah. Say hell no. Hell, hell no. Jump on there real quick. Let me see that. All right, give it five. All right. All right. Let's give them a round of applause. I'm going to put the bike on hold. Do you have your tag? I'll get a tag. Okay. Today. The day starts off well. The buyers are excited, and the team is really moving inventory. Okay. How's that? Yeah, I like that. But despite the initial rush, the slashers don't feel like they're getting enough support from the sales staff. Your money's walking away from you, buddy. Stay with them. Try and talk them back into it. You know, why, why let them just totally disengage from you? So don't give up from the sale. That's the other thing. When we learned, if you let a customer leave and they walked, you left. You went home with them. We found you in your car. What, what's really happening, John? Is everything okay? No, I'm not. 
Okay, but you're coming back, right? Because we need you, man. We need you. Can you sell another bike today before we leave? Yeah. You promise? All right, that's what I'm talking about. All right. Then the